Hi, babes. Hey, boo. Okay. Oh my gosh. So while I was at the Walmart style tour, they had, uh, of course, like some of their fall collections from different brands there. So people can just like look and see how to put pieces together, et cetera, et cetera. Um, but the only thing is they only had sample sizes. And if you wanted, if you was interested in a piece that we basically told people, you know, go inside of a store or buy it online while we was there, I found this like Chanel inspired sweater. Obviously this is not it y'all. This actually, I don't even know where this sweater is from. Let me see. Oh, this, this sweater, my friend actually um, sent me this sweater from New York. Y'all, if y'all don't remember, um, Alina who I went and saw when the last time I went to New York, she got me this sweater. I, I, I so, so cute. So um, when I do wear, I do a little number or something like this or whatnot. Um, or I'll just like leave it open, whatever case maybe. So anyway, back to the sweater at Walmart. So this sweater is kind of like a Chanel inspired sweater. So I got it on site. We only had a small, so I did try it on. The small wasn't bad, but I like my sweaters to be a little bit baggy. So I got a medium and a large and it actually came in the mail today. So we're gonna walk downstairs to go get it. We're going to unbox it and I'll try it on. You guys let me know. Go with the medium, go with the large. But in between time, y'all, y'all see my hair? Eh, 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 eh. So this girl recommended me to this place to go to. I'm not going to say the place because y'all, I did not have the best experience. So needless to say, I'm not going back. I was telling one of my friends about my experience or whatever. And she was like, well, nothing's going to be perfect, et cetera, et cetera. I get that. I'm not being picky. However, if I lower my standards to things that I pay my money to, absolutely not. Like what? I refuse to lower my standards or expectations with people, things, places where I'm spending my hard earned money, especially in a recession. Like we're not doing it. And I am not saying that the person who I'm going to find for my hair is going to be like, you know, somewhere closer or compared to Jesus. That's not what I'm saying. Cause we're still human. Anyway, y'all Houston weather finally broke quote unquote. Like we got below 70 degrees. Oh, so excited. Unfortunately it is not saying this. We only enjoy for two days. It only been cool in Houston for two days. So tomorrow the temperature is supposed to be rising back up or whatnot, but it is feeling so good outside. Um, unfortunately it's going to be warmer. I think it's going to get to like back to the nineties. So ew, yeah. Anyway, let's go get this box. Hey y'all. All right. Let's get to unboxing. Okay. Y'all. Okay. Y'all let's go. medium and a large their medium is it has like 8 10 so size is 8 and 10 and then a large is 12 14 this is by free assembly this sweater is $28 of course I'm gonna link it down below just in case anybody's interested oh first of all the quality soft but it's thick here it is and I'm gonna take this sweater off feels so good like plush I like the gold details of it. So just cause y'all can't see it. We have like these gold buttons, hardware, if you want to call it. And so, okay. Okay. So the arms is a lit slightly, slightly short for me. Keep in mind, I'm 5'10", so my arms are longer than most, average. But it's not bad. You know, it's not bad. It did seem like I have a little bit of a stretch. 
So I'm pretty sure if I just, I could stretch these, stretch this out if I wanted to. Um, so I do like this, but let's put it on a medium to see if I feel a little bit better in it. Okay, so this is the medium, no, this is the large. This is the large. Okay, it doesn't feel as snug, so I like that. Girl, the sleeves are shorter. The sleeves are shorter. What? Okay. Why? The sleeves are shorter, which I don't like. It should be longer because it's a bigger size. This feels looser. So we do like, oh, we actually have pockets. These are two fake pockets, but these are two real pockets. I love that it does have pockets or whatever. Um, I feel that you can actually wear this multiple ways out. You can have it open. So you can have it open, which is good. Like a doo -doo. This is cute. Um, Y'all, I don't know how I feel. I don't know how I feel about these sleeves. This could be, I mean, it could be a cute little number or whatever. So I gotta figure out just which one I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep. Cause I do like a couple statement pieces to like, you know, elevate your wardrobe or whatnot, but the sleeves or whatever is kind of taking me out a little bit. So I got to figure that out. It is still cold here. Y'all know, well, y'all don't know. In Texas, we not, we not used to the weather getting this low. Heck, we probably, it probably don't get this low again for a while. So we are appreciative of it, but y'all will not act when it get below 75. I am, I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna do. I don't know if I wanna to go to Trader Joe's or not. What we need to do is, we need to find an outfit for the concert. We don't know what we're wearing, meaning we, I, I don't know what I'm wearing. So I guess let's go try on some outfits to possibly wear to the concert. Um. Okay, after looking at my clothes and such, I think I'm going to, I just wore this. Um, but looking at my clothes and such, and then with the weather being a little odd in a sense. So it's supposed to warm up this weekend. So tomorrow's Friday. Yeah, tomorrow's Friday and it's supposed to warm up. But I'm pretty sure at night it's gonna be a little bit chilly again. Maybe I gotta check the weather again, but anyway, inside those stadiums or whatever, it's typically cold, and I really don't want to hold anything extra than I have to because they already sent an email about, um, like their bag policy. So, if you have a bag that's bigger than like I think four inches wide or something like that, then they will have you to either go back to go put it back in your car. Or you can lock it up in one of their little bins or whatever for uh, at a charge. I just raided my closet and I picked up all of these shirts. This is I, all these are shirts with the exception of this. This is a dress. Oh, so this is a dress, and I was thinking about just wearing this as a top, and then just you know stuff in the bottom part. But now I'm thinking I'm probably doing too much. I do like the print though. I like that it's a print. But maybe. And oh, by the way, if I did not say, I'm going to the Maxwell concert. So it is, Maxwell is headlining along with Jasmine Sullivan and then the special guests or whatever you call it, or a quote unquote opener is October London. So 
it's gonna be it's gonna be good but anyway i'm going to the concert by myself and yeah and y'all know like once i got in the mode so a couple blogs ago whatever i was doing some self-reflection and i was thinking like okay so you're gonna stop and not do the things that you want to do because you don't have anybody to go with like either on demand or because of your relationship status no lately i have been traveling like i got on a plane arrived to the airport left the airport you know solo but once i got to my destination like somebody met met up with me and um i think i'm gonna do like a real solo solo trip before the year's out i don't know these hurricanes and everything else is kind of like just throwing me off but we gonna get there however while we're at home in the city we do more things by ourselves like go to the grocery store stuff like that that's that's nothing i'm not a big fan of the movies so i wouldn't go there but going to a restaurant or sitting at the bar I'll, I'll do that at first i was like uh, i don't want to but oh single ladies if you're in any city go to bars go to restaurants by yourself believe it or not when you majority of time i ain't say it's not a guarantee but majority of time when you go to sit the bar by yourself happy hour whatever by yourself men will approach you more and you may get your food taken care of just you know anyway it's not a, but again it's not a guarantee uh whatnot but it's really good to help you kind of like just get out of your own mode and really see what you like, what you don't like. And if you don't like your own company, how do you expect somebody else to like it? Okay. Anyway, so back to the clothes. I think what I'm going to do. So we're wearing tennis shoes. That's a, that's a given. I was going to wear like slides or whatever, but I'm thinking like, what if I got to run? So we're not doing that. And I'm not wearing heels because... I ain't got time for that. I my feet be hurting, and mm -mm, I think the older I got, the less I wear heels. I need, I mean, I wear heels, but but I'm not wearing them like just on a random Tuesday, and we ain't doing much. We're going to, I don't know, going to a pop up shop or something. Like, nah, I used to be that, be like that though. Like, I wear heels seven days a week. Anyway, so we're gonna wear tennis shoes. I think I'm gonna wear like long um we're well not long like i'm gonna wear like wide leg or relaxed type cut jeans and a girly top so i was thinking about this i like this top it got a little lush and the sleeves are mesh so depending on the weather it could be okay but if it's cold in there i may still be the back is see-through too um i may still be cold anyway so i got this is an option I got this this is a crop top <sighs> i don't know i feel like it depends on what type of pants i wear this may be an option i will only wear the top not the whole piece set um i got like this little number this is a bodysuit so we good good i like this little peekaboo action um and then here's another this is similar to the shirt i just got on this hanger it does no justice but it's a cutout there and it's a bodysuit as well. Long sleeve. Um, what else I got? I got this simple shirt. It has like a little, a little detail-ish. It's not turtleneck, but it's not low. Then, y'all can't really even see what this look like. And I got this actual turtleneck, but no sleeve top. White, you never can go wrong with white, so... If I get frustrated, that's probably what I'll put on. And I had this little uh, number right here. This is cute because it have a little ruching. Y'all really can't tell because it's on, on a hanger. But it has like this ruching on the top and on the side. And it's a bodysuit as well. But then if I want to just spice it up. Yeah, this is giving me sexy. So I have this, but I may be cold. So I don't know. I'm going to try these on or whatever. But if I'm not flustered tomorrow when I'm getting dressed, I would, um, I would do a get ready with me. If not, then, you know, we'll just be talking on the way there. And then, of course, when I get to the concert, I'm going to record off my phone and not on the camera. Because if they're already tripping about the size of the bag, they may be tripping about the camera. So I don't want to take no risks because you can't check, you can't hold, you can't do anything with my camera. Okay. 
Uh, all right, let me figure out what I'm gonna do. I think I am gonna go to Trader Joe's. I think I am. So let me go put on some jeans and put that sweater back on so we can go outside. Okay, so obviously we're not in Trader Joe's. Y'all, it was too much going on. It was just too many people in there. So it was too many, excuse me, my pardons, and not enough of get out of my way. So I didn't record as much as I wanted to in Trader Joe's, but I will show y'all what I got when I get to the house. However, so I've seen this post. I have it in my like saves on Instagram. So I have it like in my saves folders. For this particular place in Houston that has 75 cents drinks on Thursdays. We're about to go check them out. So I believe the, the name of the place is called Karna Korean Steakhouse. I think that's what it's called. Um, when I looked at the menu, they have more than steak. But I, we're only here for a drink. And we're only getting one because we got stuff in the, in the trunk. Or whatever that needs to be put in the freezer so we're not gonna stay long i just wanted to check them out because i was already outside and it's thursday in the meantime while i was trying to find some lip gloss y'all know like we have lip gloss in a car in a purse in a different purse at home in whatever like we live we leave uh lip glosses and stuff all everywhere so i thought i had an extra lip gloss in the little middle part of the car I couldn't find it. However, I found this little this little guy. I don't know if y'all remember. I did um, uh, a video for DGI uh, accessories. And I thought I had lost it. I was literally about to get ready to buy this. But it was in the car the whole time. So, burr, 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 burr. yay. Okay. I'm about to put it right back where I found it. So, y'all, if y'all hear me complaining about it again, just tell me to go right there. Okay. All right, friend. Okay, let's go check out this place and get a 75 cents drink. Of course, we're gonna sit at the bar. Okay? All right, let's go. Hi. Uh, can I sit at the bar? Um, you guys still have like your Thursday specials and stuff? Okay, cool. Thank you. I love your hair. Excuse me, what's restroom? Yeah, it's gonna be right that side. The line of the purple sign? Okay. Are you waiting for a 75 cent martini? You know it, this is my first time. I've been sitting on Instagram, so. You came at a good time, because I think this is the last month we're doing it. Really? Yeah. Make sure your menu. And I'll get you some water to start off. Thank you. Y'all, this place is cute. It's definitely like a date night type atmosphere or if you're looking for somebody in particular, if you know what I mean. Um, you, have to, you just gotta come at the right time. And this is off of, um, hey, I forgot what the name of the street is, but it's in the Heights. It's in the Heights and there's other restaurants that across the street and close by, so it should be fine. Um, or whatever, but I mean, so far the service is good. They're nice, complimentary. Oh, and they told me that the 75 cents martini menu is the. This is the last month that they're doing it. So if you plan on trying them out, especially on a Thursday when they have the 75 cents drinks, you may want to come like right when you see this video. Okay, bye. I 
get it right back She put it all on me, I couldn't fight that She love when I were on it, when it's tied back You know it's hard to get Cheers Love when I were on it, when it's tied back Cheers Love when I were on it, when it's tied back Y'all, another good thing about this place, they understand the assignment about water. No tap water over here. Mm. I love this. Diamonds gone dead. Even though I'm not your man, you're not my girl. I'ma call you mine. Cause I can't stand to see you treated bad. I'll be this ass for my heart. And we ain't did nothing that we ain't supposed to do. Cause you're mine. Hey y'all, I'm back home. So I came in um or whatnot, took some trash out, um uh, kind of cleaned up my car in a sense. Like I had to get that mirror that was out of my trunk. But as promised, I told y'all that I was going to show y'all what I got from Trader Joe's. So let's get into it. Some eggs, enchilada sauce. Sun-dried tomatoes, maple syrup. I literally just put, I just brought maple syrup back into my diet. So I'm like taking it easy when I use syrup. But knowing that syrup is sugar and sugar feeds a fibroid, limited, 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 limited. But I also knew like, if I deprive myself even more, I'm gonna go searching for it at another place that I don't need to. Anyway, so, Vanilla paste. These are for my matchas when I make. Some olives. Two things of coconut water. This, this look at this sauce. It's like chimichurri sauce. But I saw this and it was like 50 cents less. So I was like, it's the same thing. Let's give it a try. Some chicken sausage, jalapeno. Cheddar chicken sausage. Got guacamole. Former chicken thigh, vegetable medley. We have some waffle fries, broccoli fourlets, ricotta and spinach filled ravioli. Oh, fettuccine alfredo. Some sparkling white. This is great. Basically, just sparkling grape juice. Some Celsius water. When I do want to partake in alcohol, green sparkling water. Y'all, the green apple, if y'all ever go to Trader Joe's, get the green apple. Put it in the refrigerator. Y'all would not, you would not be disappointed. A case of water that y'all see back here. Unfortunately, I did that thing where I tried to pack all the bags inside the house the same time and the water won. I have a couple of these bottles of water just like out. That's it. Ta-da! Oh, let me show y'all my flower before I start cutting them up. Wait. It's some fillers, some rose lilies. These are cow lilies. Uh, hey, this is the color combo.
Okay, y'all. So I think I'm going to end the vlog off here so that we can do a full weekend vlog tomorrow. So yes, tomorrow we get to go see Maxwell and Jasmine Sullivan along with October London. So excited. Anyway, thank you guys for joining me on this vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you have not. I appreciate you guys for watching. In the meantime, between time, take care of yourself, and I'll see you later. Bye. You want, I will do. You're the only one.